What's up guys and welcome back to Creepy Nights at Freddy's. Now in the last video, I really don't know what we did because this we played the demo about a few months ago and now we have the fully released version of the game. Now I don't know if it's out on Game Joe just yet. The, the developer of the game actually sent it to me, I guess a little bit early. Like I said, I really don't know if it's out or not, but we have the full release. So obviously I had to do a video on it for you guys. But of course, if you guys want a chance to win any Final Freddy's game completely for free, all you have to do is leave a like on the video, leave a comment down below saying what Final Freddy's game you want. And of course, hit that subscribe button and the little bell icon and that is it you are entered to win it's really that simple now anyways let's go ahead and press new game and hop into this so it's been a little while though since i played this and from what i heard he actually added some cool things into it like a lot of surprises and easter eggs so this should be relatively fun freddy fazer's pizza family pizzeria looking for a security guard to work the night shift 12 a.m to 6 a.m monitor cameras ensure safety okay <laughs> 12 a.m the first night all right i'm excited to get into this man whoa what is this Okay, uh, use WSD to move, press E to interact with objects, F to turn off and on flashlight, press spacebar to open and close cameras, hold left shift to run, hold M to mute, okay, press control to crouch slash uncrouch, press escape to pause. Okay, first things first, mute. Okay, that muted the call, perfect. All right, so we're gonna start with that. Guys, do you guys wanna hear the call, yes or no? Okay, everyone comment down below, yes or no, if you wanna hear the calls in this game, because I really do need to know right away. So going on in the series, if you guys wanna hear them, we can play them. And if not, we can obviously mute them just like that. And uh, yeah, that's it. Okay, so how do we get this thing on? Oh, uh, what? Whoa! Oh my, wait, what the heck? I did not, I thought the game froze, but I looked down and look at this. My body, I'm, am I the purple guy? What's that noise? Oh, it's this light flickering. I think I'm playing as the purple guy. Okay. It said F for flashlight, didn't it? It's not working. Oh, I gotta pick it up. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow. Okay, that's probably why it doesn't show our arms. We're literally the purple guy. That is, ew, look at our nasty toes, dude. That's so gross. We're like missing toes and stuff. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, let's hop on the cams. Dude, I like this already. We're playing as the purple guy. That is so cool. Okay, cams are everywhere. They're kind of hard to tell what's what, though. Because, you know, everything is... It's all staticky. Okay, that's interesting. I, I can't believe we're playing as a glowing purple guy. That is so awesome. I've never seen this before in a fan game. Dude, I like this game already. <laughs> I just want to look at myself like Rod. Look at this. We're like a little purple dude running around. Oh, that's incredible, man. That's so good. Okay, let's head out here. Let's kind of explore the area here. Okay, you got uh, the closet, obviously, with a camera. Okay, never seen anyone put a camera right in the middle of a room on the ceiling. You usually put them in like a corner or something, but that was smack dab right in the middle. Okay, we got Foxy's Pirate Cove. That, that's good to see. Are you in there, bro? I think I saw him. Yeah, there he is. He's in there. All right. What's that noise? Wait, is Chica? No, Chica's there. Okay, I think I'm hearing myself. It's gotta be. Okay, so we have Freddy, Bonnie, and Chica right there. Now, they shouldn't be activating anytime soon. You got the endoskeleton, which is huge. Oh, that's so creepy. I just, I feel like one of these days we're gonna walk up to him and he's just gonna activate. Like, his eyes are just gonna turn on and I'm just gonna run for my life. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, hey, somebody dropped a cup right here. Can't pick it up, though. All right. Uh, let's go in the kitchen, maybe? No, we can't go in there. Of course not. Golden Freddy's in there. All right, now, what about the exit? Okay, we can't go through there either. Dang it. All right, now, we got the bathrooms right here. Another... Ooh. Never seen an employees-only room in here. Interesting. Oh, dude, that's so cool. The cameras... I gotta watch the amateur. Okay, the cameras actually move back and forth. That I've never seen in a fan game before. That's pretty awesome. It's like the simplest things are so cool. Oh, the bathroom's open. Wow. Okay, this, this game is already advanced, bro. <laughs> it's already advanced. You can open the bathroom doors, man. I can never do that in any other FNAF fan game. All right, what about these ones? Is there anything in them? No, they're all kind of, like, empty. be interesting to see, like, just something hidden in these, but I guess not. I bet you if you go here, like, on a certain night, there'll be something in there. But for right now, it's empty. Now, we're at that point where the animatronics... What's that noise? Okay, no. Oh, that's in real life. I thought that was in the game. It scared me. Okay, so we're at the point, though... Well, the animatronics should start moving pretty soon here. So I'm going to head back to the office, okay? Keep an eye on them. I don't know how fast they are. I don't know how slow they are. I don't know what they're going to do, but we got to be careful. All right, camera system. Uh, camera 1A. Oh, I hate this static. I Are they all gone? Wait, look. Camera 1A is the stage. I don't see anyone. Are they gone? 
Hello? Oh, oh, Bonnie's moving. Bonnie's moving. Oh my god, he looks so creepy and like realistic looking. All right, let's go over here. Is he about to... Oh, he's coming to the door. Wait, now what happens if he sees me? Does he start running? Hello? Bonnie? Oh my god, look, his head... Oh my god, his ears moved the little stars. What? I've only seen that where they like go right through them. I love that he added that in. Okay, so Bonnie, he's moving, but he can't seem to get to us. Like, he, he's not trying to get us, it seems like. So I'm guessing he's on like a pattern where he's going to go in there and then come out here and walk this way. I think the real threat with this game is going to be Foxy because he's going to run. These guys don't seem to be running even when they see me, which is very... Yeah, they're still on the stage. Like, even when they see me, they still don't seem to like running. So, Bonnie, are you... No, I shouldn't do that. No, I shouldn't do that. I should not do that. Oh, no, I'm not going to do it. Oh, no, 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 I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I want to look in there and see if he's in there, but no, it's a bad idea. Oh, by the way, guys, I want to ask you guys, is it currently cold where you guys are living? Because obviously we're getting closer to December. We're about to go into November. And it, it's like, it's, it's, I live in Florida where it's like always super hot. And over here, it's finally starting to get a little bit cold. So I want to know, is it cold where you guys are? And of course, you know, on a cold day like this, what game do you guys like to play? Like, what's your, what's your go-to game that you play during like the winter months? Because my go-to games, I got a few of them. You know, I got like Fallout. I love Fallout 3, 4, and New Vegas. Those I always have to hop on. You got Kingdom Hearts, Bioshock. Like, th there's a wide variety of games, but I want to know what you guys play around this time of year. Because I am genuinely interested in hearing that. Because, like, I want to know. Because, like, I don't know. Like, I always I always thought about that. Like, every time of the year, there's a certain game that you just, you got to pull out and you got to play, you know, a little bit of it. Just just to get that feeling back, you know? All right, let's keep looking around, though, for these guys. Camera 7. Bonnie left, interestingly enough. I thought for sure he would have just came right over here, but I guess not. Is Chica? Oh, no. I don't think Chica's on the stage anymore. No. Okay, we should get back to the room. Uh, where's Chica? Oh crap. Okay, another thing. Where's the power meter at? I didn't see that. It might. It might have said it on that instructions panel in the beginning, but I got so distracted by being the purple man that I just. Oh. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> that scared me. I got so distracted by being the purple man though that I completely forgot about that. I completely forgot about what all of those instructions said. All right, second night, guys. Here we go. I figure we'll do nights one and two in one video. And uh, in the next video, we'll do two and four. And then after that, we'll do night five and what as, whatever's after that. All right, but unfortunately, we do have to mute this because, you know, I don't have your votes in yet. <laughs> so I can't see what you guys are saying if you want to hear it or not. But then again, I mean, it is just the FNAF 1 phone call. I'm pretty sure. I don't think he, like, re... -re oh, no, the, the flashlight. Oh, I keep forgetting about that. It's so easy to forget about because, like, I'm so used to having it. I feel like if you, well, if you grab it on one night, I feel like you should just keep it. Then again, I guess if you go home for the night, you wouldn't uh, bring it home with you. I keep checking these areas because I just, I want to make sure nothing changes in here. Oh, wait, what? It's, oh, he's in there. Oh my, dude, I, I saw it to the left. I didn't see him in there. That freaked me out. I thought he was genuinely like gone. That would have been really creepy. Just one night you go up to Pirate Cove and he's just not there. It's like, okay, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go lock myself in the room forever. I think he's active on this night though. I don't know man He's the, he's the biggest like he's the scariest one because he's gonna full sprint into my office I, I don't understand this cam one though. like I feel like he added too much static because I can see Bonnie I can see a little bit of Freddy right there, and I can't see Chica at all I really wish that static was a little bit calmed down like I don't even know why they add static into this. I feel like it'd just be better if you could just see. Like, it makes sense, though. We're in, like, an old diner, an old pizzeria. And, you know, there's static on cameras. But, I mean, come on. <laughs> just have the updated cameras where I can actually see what's happening. I can't tell what's happening on any of these. Like, if there's an animatronic in here, I cannot see them. Oh, uh, let's see. No, nothing. Like, if they were clear, I'd use them a lot more often. Oh, that's how you can see your power percentage, though. In that room. Yeah, bottom left. Power left. Okay. So... Wait, we don't really, wait, what, why is that, okay, I just realized that sound is like the sound of a light going off, but, now these are just always on, we don't really use any of our power though, so I think we're, go oh wait, does the flashlight use power, ooh, I don't know, maybe I shouldn't use it, well, then again, how would the flashlight use power for the building, it uses batteries, not, it's not like I haven't plugged into a wall when I'm walking around with like a cord, this is like a, oh god, Dude, my own walking keeps freaking me out. 
It keeps freaking me out, dude. I don't know. I keep thinking it's an animatronic. They're all still there. What about Foxy? Okay, Foxy's still there too. Oh, I don't know. But yeah, like I was saying, like I feel like you should be able to use the flashlight endlessly. Or you know what you should do? You should put like a battery meter on it and then maybe like put a set of batteries somewhere hidden on the map every round, like every night. So you have to find it if you use your bat like if you use your flashlight that much. But I don't know. It's <laughs> just an idea. All right, let's just stay out of their way, though. Like I said, this is the really, this is the slowest part of these games. Whenever they remake Final Fantasy Freddy's, is the beginning because, like, you know, the beginning of every FNAF, you know, game is really slow. Like FNAF one, FNAF two, every game on nights one and two, everything's slow. As soon as you get to night three, it jumps up in pace and it's like insanity. <laughs> so it's like. You just gotta you gotta make it through the first few nights without getting attacked because you still can get attacked on these nights But if you can make it through it, you're good to go on to the real nights, all right the real challenges But yeah, I, I also heard like I said that there's some Easter eggs in this game, so I don't know What is that? Oh, it's the red light. That's weird there's one on that side, too Never really seen that before. I don't think that, that's not in the original office What do I put those there just to make it a little bit more creepy? I guess but yeah, I have a feeling there's like some secrets here. So like I've been trying to press E on everything and see if we can find something. It'd be really cool though if like a game developer just added in like a secret door. Like you turn around, you press E and it just opens up and it's got like, it's an animatronic museum. Like that would be so cool. Like all the animatronics from the game, you know how they usually have that in like the extras menu? Just put it right here, hide it right here. You press E, boom, opens up. <laughs> That'd be so cool. I know that's not I mean it would it, would, it wouldn't really be up oh, there Shiga moving it wouldn't really be you know too plausible because you know let's say this is like we're on night five I open the door I just go in there and hide <laughs> but like maybe you can't go in there you know you can't get out of there when you go and like it ends the night like that night doesn't count or something like that I don't know here comes Bonnie let's see what he does though is he going to no he's going that way yeah he's going into the closet yep there he goes <laughs> just like that into the closet. Oh, and by the way, guys, I, I mentioned this in, like, one video before this, but I am a little bit sick, so, if, you know, I have, like, a stuffed nose. So, if you hear that, that's why. Uh, <laughs> I've been trying to, like, not make it so obvious, but it's really hard. And, oh, my God. Close. Holy. Are we okay? Holy crap. <laughs> oh, I thought I was done for right there. <laughs> Luckily, he runs slow. I think he's gone now. Yeah. Holy, uh, like I was saying though, a little bit sick because, you know, winter time and stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. If you hear any, like, sniffles or if I sound a little bit weird, that's why. Um, yeah, it's just, it's like one of those things you just can't control. I'm sure all of you guys are out there sick too. How many of you guys have a stuffed nose? I'm sure, like, everybody watching probably does. Well, depending on where you live. But, yeah, it, it's just like, it's just something that happens around this month. You just, you can't control it. All right, so Foxy, interesting, interestingly enough though, like, he ran up here. And I had enough time to panic and then close the door, so <laughs> he's pretty slow. We I don't think we really have to watch the cameras. Like at all. Like I, I can look at oh I saw Chica. I can look at them to like see where the animatronics are, but that's about it. Look at how slow she is. <laughs> She's so slow. Come here, Chica. Hurry up. Get over here. I'm gonna close it now. Why not? I have so much power and it's it's 4 a.m. I think I could literally close both of the doors. And I'd be fine. Like, they can't get in here. And even Foxy, he doesn't run fast enough to get in here. There's Chica. Oh, no. She's at the door. Don't open it. Gotta make sure we keep that closed. We definitely do not want Chica coming in here at any point. All right? So, this night... Oh, yeah. And there's a clock behind us, too. Ah, I like it. So, it's 440 right now. Now, it's 445. Almost. Man. You know what's weird? It's been a while since I've seen one of these clocks. Like, when you're in school, like, elementary school especially... Which I'm sure some of you guys out there are. Um, you always see clocks like this. Because I guess they want you to like learn how to read time properly and stuff like that. But like in real life, I, I haven't seen one of these in holy <laughs> like seven years. I don't know. I haven't seen one of these in forever. Like most teachers in high school and middle school. I think middle school probably still has them. But high school, they just don't use those clocks anymore. You know, they just it's all digital and stuff like that. This is like a, this is a relic from the past right here on this wall. Even though it's really not like I don't know. It's just it's just one of those things All right, I think we're I mean I could probably open the doors right now, but there's no point I'm at I'm at 58% power and it's 5 a.m. And Bonnie's still out there. I am curious though if I open this Does he jump scare me immediately or will he try to walk in or will he just stand there? 
Should I do it? <laughs> Should I open the door when he's right there? No, I'm not gonna do it. That's that's risky. That's just that's asking to just get attacked. But yeah, oh, oh yeah, guys, I forgot about. Oh, what the heck just happened? Okay, that was weird. You guys probably didn't see it, but my Steam opened up and I thought the game like froze. Um, but yeah, guys, let me know what you think of this. All right, the fact that we are the Purple Man is that cool or not? That that's cool. Like that's awesome. We're literally the Purple Man in like tattered up clothing. That's so cool. Oh, whoa. Uh-oh, don't tell me Golden Freddy's coming. It's 5 a.m. Don't tell me he's active. I think we're okay. That could be a problem. I forgot about Golden Freddy. Uh-oh. Come on, why isn't the night ending? We've been on... Oh, there we are. Woo, I thought for a second Golden Freddy was about to pop up and, like, start doing stuff. I don't know. Like, I thought things were about to get wild right there. All right, third night, guys. This is, uh... This is it. That's where I'm gonna end the video, though. So... Part one, we beat nights one and two. Obviously, like I said, those were the easy parts of the night. There, that was just like it, it's that's no challenge at all. You, you just gotta stand there in a corner, and that's it. You're fine. But on this night, is where things are gonna go bad. Why do I keep? Oh, you can go back. Wait a second. This might be a bug. I think. Oh, we can go all the way over here. Wait, what's stopping me from just camping over here? Oh, you can hide under the table. Oh, my God. What the? Dude, that scared the crap out of me. Why is he? He moved. He moved. Oh, my God. He's actually moving. He's actually moving. Oh, my God. He's actually moving. Oh. Oh, my God. What's happening? Dude, what is happening with this game right now? What just happened? Holy crap. What just happened? It just reset. It reset the ratio. Okay, are we okay? What was that? I hold on. Okay, the video was supposed to end there, but wait a second. I was, I okay. Here was the plan, right? I was gonna go into that room, right, and hide behind the door and see if I could survive the night that way. But then I, I decided to hide under the table, and the endoskeleton did not like that. He came to life. Wait, is it just? Oh my gosh, dude, that's creepy. Is it? Cause I was. Oh my, dude, he moves. He moves. He actually moves. Is it because I'm on night three or is it because I'm going underneath this table? Oh my. Oh my god. Oh my. Holy crap, dude. That is so cool. That is so cool. I don't like how it sets my ratio every time I get attacked, but that is so cool. <laughs> Wait a second. Hold on. I gotta see. Is that. Okay. Is that just on night three that he activates? Like, was that just bad luck? Or is it because we're underneath his table? Oh, I'm gonna crouch over here. Okay, he doesn't do anything. Wait, what if I... No, okay. No, see, he's not doing it. I don't know, dude. That's creepy. I don't know if it's because I went underneath his table or what, but no, no, no. He, like, he crawls after you, too. Wait, I never thought, what if we sit in here, too? Like, there's all these spots that we can just camp in. I'm wondering if we do. Can we beat the knight? Hold on. Oh, no, is that him? No, that's just the... Okay, hold on. I need to go over here and see. Oh, dude, that's creepy. Okay, he's still here. Is it? Is it because I'm in here? No, look, like he's not active now. I think it's literally because I'm hiding. Oh, maybe that's what he's done to stop people from hiding. That makes sense to stop people from camping under the table because the other animatronics can't get you if you do that. He's added this guy where he activates and crawls so he can crawl and get you under the table. So I bet you if you hide in that bathroom, he'll probably crawl over there and get me too. Wait, what if I'm not under the table and I just crouch? Yeah, look at that. He, oh, see, as soon as you go to go under the table, maybe this is like his warning. Oh no, Bonnie's active. I think he, I think that was just like a warning though. Oh no, he's coming. Yeah, he's coming. Nope, nope, time to go. Time to go. Uh. How fast is he? I don't want to know. Close that. Close that. Okay, guys. I'm ending this video here. That is such a cool way to, like, get people to not camp, though. To just activate a whole animatronic that can just crawl around and chase you. Is he back? No, he's still gone. I think he's active the entire night now. Oh, that is just terrifying. Where, Where is he? Yeah, he, he doesn't go back. I think he's actually outside the door. Is he just sitting out there? I don't know. Guys, I'm in this video here, though. 
If you guys want a part two, maybe tonight, maybe tomorrow, be sure to leave a like on the video. Leave a comment down below saying part two. And of course, hit that subscribe button and the bell icon, like I said. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.